Get up, she won't get up in a shot. She's moving. The police are describing Thursday's gun attack on a bus which left two women dead and five others, including a two year old child injured on St. John's Road in Spanish Town, St. Catherine. A reprisal. And I don't know if you remember, but back in January, them they killed a youth from over Tel Aviv when he weed seed. Weed seed um, was like a gangster youth, and I guess these people were in attendance at his funeral. Let's move up. Mm. Get up on the side. Mm. When we can't see the man, them over here, but that means you know, they're going to come from boy, I'm not going to do it. say about three to four man, they have come off of the car. Anything like, mm. a two hours ago, everybody have a gun. And it's open fire. That's all I'm saying. And they start to cover. Everybody start panicking. As if I see the bus. The deceased have been described as Onika Carter of George's Lee and Kingston and Tracy and Senior a parade yard in Central Kingston. There was also a two-year-old boy shot and two teenagers, age 17, shot as well. the first time it's going on up here with you. A few times when this happened up here. Well, break out of the already where people lose all them hands. You understand? Mm -hmm. I think I need to put some more top images in place in terms of security. These type of actions have become such a common place in our society that there's, there's no shock value to it anymore. There's no outrage. The only time the outrage comes is when the security forces kill a perpetrator of a crime like this. But no outrage when the perpetrators kill innocent people. Me even hear a vlogger go so far as to say them come a bad man funeral. So, you know, these type of things are to be expected. And while what he said may be true, when you turn a blind eye to things like these, you become a part of the problem. At what point did it become acceptable to have to plan your own funeral in order for your ten one? Why you can't go pay respects to the dead regardless of what their background is without ending up dead? Once you start to accept things like these or turn a blind eye to things like these, you become a part of the problem. Rest in peace. Anika Carter, a.k.a. Coco. Rest in peace to Tracy and a speedy recovery to everybody that's in the hospital right now.